I thought I'd do an hamster supply video uh, showing you all the supplies and things that I've got sorry about it being a bit dull today but it's really bad weather outside it's all dark and gloomy so first off I've got this cute little itty bitty bitty hamster igloo uh, which is suitable for dwarves and robos uh, now I tested it out with my Razabi and he's a dwarf, a Russian Campbell and he can get in this uh, but I'm saving this from a raw ball I've got this little blue house I've got Two more igloos, these are the next size up for Serians. I've got a pink and a blue, and they've got nice glitter on them. These are uh, used to be Tilly's house, Matilda's house, but Shout grew it, it was a bit too big, so I mean, a bit too small for her. I've still got my Kitty's house. Which, you, which you've seen it in my cage tour because uh, Matilda started to use it as a poop house uh, so I've got um, two of them and I've uh, also got this cute little strawberry house which is absolutely adorable I've got the cute little orange house which is adorable I've got the cute little pear house. I thought I might as well collect them all. So I'll just put these back here so they stay nice and neat. Let's put them in there a minute and then I'll get cracking with the others to show you what I've got. There's your little itty bitty glue. I also got this, I got this a long while ago and um I'm saving this for when I get a raw bowl. And I've got quite a few of these for uh, fur plus houses. I've got, um, let's see, I've still got Kitty's grey one. So I've got one, two greys. I've still kept uh, some of Kitty's toys, well, the plastic one. I've got two blues. Plus the one that's in Rizabi's cage. So I've got three blues. Got a red one. I've got two of these. A cute little itty bitty bridge. I've got a cheese house. Which has got a hole at the top. And a hole there. In yellow. Also got one. In pink, and I finally got one in green, which uh, you've seen in my previous hauls. So I'll just pop them back in dead neat so I don't have to look about in a bit so I can get this video done quick for you guys. There we go, everything back in its place. Then I've got uh, some bridges here, these little bridges, wooden bendy bridges, always have some of them in. A little roundabout, which you've seen in my Rizabi's cage, but this is a spur one. So this is the first drawer, I'll go and get the second drawer now. Right, this is the second drawer. Another little strawberry house, but this is a teeny weeny 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 little one. For a little raw bowl. Cute little sand bath for a raw bowl. It's only for a raw bowl this. Even a dwarf wouldn't be able to get in this without a squeeze. So I've got everything kitted out for when I do get my raw bowl. I've got these little oil burners. This one's a small wide chubby one. So this is good for um, dwarves and raw balls. I've got another one, another spotty one. Just 
put that strawberry house there because I don't want to break it's made of ceramic. I've got these cute little toilets. So um now I've not tried wasabi in this, so I don't think he'll get in it. Um so this is I've got two of these, so this these are gonna be for me raw balls or raw ball. Got a cute little raw ball here glue. A sofa. Again, this is for dwarfs and raw balls. Let's put the food balls there for a minute. I've got another, I've got quite a few of these in different colours. Another little robo sand bath or toilet. Uh, these are what they like when they're not put together. This one's in pink. And what else have we got? I've got a cute little owl eyed out. Turn him that way. These will be good for summer to keep them cool. Again, for dwarves and raw balls. Little raw ball house again, a little pencil and pencil. Pen and pencil, I mean. Another little raw ball. This is a little pig. So this would be nice to put some forage in for a raw ball. Yeah. Here's an itty bitty orange house for a raw ball, which you've seen in my previous haul. There we go. <laughs> you have to bear with me with the lighting because of the weather. You've seen this. Uh, this has been milk carton made of ceramic for dwarves and raw balls. And uh, let's see. Ah, right. This is interesting when I get it in a minute. Put that eagle out of the way so I can get it because I'm being very careful here. This is a rocket for raw balls. You can use it as a sand bath or little food dish if they want to go inside and eat the food. Uh, yeah. And then along, here's another one. I've got two of these pink. <laughs> and then I've got another rocket. I've got a glass water bottle. Another food bowl, ceramic food bowl. I've got quite a few of these. I've got another samba, which you've seen in my cage. Uh, Rizabi's got one at the moment. Then I've got some of these corner potties. I've got quite a few of these. So, yeah. That's... Uh, these are my bo uh, food bowls, spur food bowls. And a bigger food bowl for Serian. And some spotty balls. And that's part one. I'll do a part two next. See you in a minute, guys. Hi, guys. Welcome to part two. And these are the last bits. Now, here, which I'll keep you from me, Robo, when I get him or her, there's a little itty bitty um, seesaw. <laughs> Just put it back in the drawer. And then this is also for a raw ball. It's got little ladders going up to a, 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 a little chair. It's, it's got a little hole where it's got like a little, you can put forage in there or a little bit of sand or whatever. It's got some little, like a step there. Uh, yeah, this is really cute. I'm saving that for my raw ball. So I'll put that up there. This is still wrapped up. This is for my robo as well. Like a little barrel, wooden barrel. Quite cute. And this is what you saw before, but the uh, the chair fell off. So what I've done is I've stuck a popsicle stick on the top, so I can still use it as a little forage box. And that uh, stick up there for them to chew on. And this is the chair that fell off. 
So what I've done is I've plastic coated it. So when I get a robot, I'll put that in the cage in the corner so they can sit on that. So yeah, so that's in there. Now I'll just go and get see what other bits I've got. Now in here there's not much in here, there's just toilet roll tubes which I've made for when I get me my robo. Right then. But I've not you've seen me do a review on these little beds, so I've not used them yet. Uh, this is uh Matilda's Matilda's coconut house, which I've took out for the time being. Um Took got two of these tubes, a blue and a red. Got some two sticks down there, more toilet rolls, and some glass bottles there. Oh, that glass bottle, sorry, with the wooden stand, which I've done a review on. And then finally, this toilet, which I've got to put in the Zabby's cage and uh, put some care fresh in and put some forage in there for him to uh, rummage. Some sign selective, mealworms, wheel stands, and four of these, which I've done reviews on. Uh, four of these drinking bottles. Yeah. So that's it, guys, for my supplies. Uh, if I get any more, I'll let you know. Bye, guys.